for the backstory today, I wanted to talk about a subject I've been seeing a lot of uh, email traffic on and chatter about, on conservative blogs especially, and that's the media's uh, perceived unwillingness to cover the taxpayer tea protest parties that have been going on around across the nation. And of course, these were inspired by CNBC's Rick Santelli's rant on the stock trader floor calling for a Tea Party protest reminiscent of the Boston Tea Party. And this really wasn't a point of contention until several uh, television outlets gave generous coverage to a group of protesters that traveled to Connecticut homes of former AIG officials to protest the uh, the bonuses that they spent taxpayer money on. And so now the tea protest people are really upset, but there's a chance they'll get their due. They're organizing nat nationwide protests on April 15th, which of course is tax day, and uh, plenty of people paying those taxes will have something to be mad about. So we'll have to see if they get their due. Uh, for now, that's the backstory. I'm Amanda Carpenter for The Washington Times.